We're eating things all the time. We're eating the air, we're eating the atmosphere, we're eating the earth, we're eating our food, we're eating our beverages. So you are what you eat can obviously be expanded, but I really like what it says in the Upanishads. It says, the subtle energy of your food becomes your mind. Thank you, Rob. You want to try some honey? Wow. Isn't it yummy? How was it? That's so good. How is it? You like it? <laughs> but the honey. Do you like it? Now take a good listen to that. The subtle energy of your food becomes your mind. Well, we can now measure how that affects our cells, how that affects our organs. That if we take a look at um, uh, those molecules of emotion, what we feed our brain literally from an emotional and spiritual standpoint. Um, in some Native American cultures, they would say that there's an ancestral legacy, whether you want to think about that as epigenetics or not, that carries through the family line. Something may have happened even emotionally generations ago that needs to be worked out by the descendants of that family. Whatever it is, our health is what we put into it. It's the work that we do. Specifically, the garden does offer a unique space in which we're able to commune with each other um, and with nature at the same time. And I think that there's a certain change in pace with which we carry ourselves when we enter the garden. There's a certain change in breathing. And I think that really makes for a space particularly conducive to building community. There's so many different things that can define what health is. Um, you can think about the ideology or the belief systems you have. You can think about you know what you feel is possible. If you don't think that something's going to work, that's working against you. We are organic farmers. I am an organic farmer. I really believe that food and how it's grown and how uh, a person decides to uh, get hold of it and um, prepare it and eat it. I, I really believe that this is at the very core of our future. And um, you can decide, you know, do you want to grow it yourself? Do you want to be in a co-op? Do you want to be in a CSA? Uh, do you want to share with a neighbor? I am an organic farmer. We are, we are organic farmers. So I believe if we can really drill down deep on you are what you eat, each of us as individuals, no matter where we are in the great chain of being, we can actually transform ourselves out of that situation and liberate our minds because food is a tremendous point of leverage. I am an organic farmer. We are organic farmers. I am an organic farmer. I am an organic farmer. We are organic farmers.